Alrighty guys, what happens if you mix a grape and an apple? You get an Andugla. Hey everybody, welcome back to another Rocket Pop Stop. Rocket Did Pop Stop! You know what that? What? Your Sunday morning delight. <laughs> Sunday! We sing too much. I uh, love Sundays. First off, it's a great, it's a, it's a good Sunday. It's a wonderful Sunday. I hope you guys it's have a day of resting. Sunday. Day of resting, and you're gonna rest in your bed, maybe your PJs, tucked with your blankie, and you'll be like, you know what? And your and your mom comes in at six o'clock in the morning, like, honey, you're gonna be late for school. I'm like, mom, it's Sunday. Okay. But you're gonna be like, what's Rocket Pop doing doing today? Rocket Pop stop today. Well, tell what you're what you're doing. You're gonna be watching us drink some Amdula. A grapple soda. Grapple. Grapple and apple. Alrighty guys, so we're pretty excited about this one. Uh, we've had this one in the fridge for a long time. This is one of our Glencoe pickups. <laughs> I still had it right this time. No, you didn't. Oh, I didn't? It's Galco. Galco! I, I, I only... <laughs> <coughs> Anyways. Uh, but again, uh, we saw this in a video quite a while ago. What it's, was the video? It's a, it's a BuzzFeed video. We'll put the link in the description. Um, Actually, the funny thing is, is our next soda will also be in that exact same video, so. The Malta Hatui. Woo but today, I'm Dudla. It's an Austrian soda. Austrian, I didn't say Australian. It sounded like it though. Austrian soda from 1957. Um, it's got a fun name, I'm Dudla. It's got a good color too. It's kind of like a light cream, almost like a, a Sprite looks like. <coughs> um, <coughs> what was the flavor described as that video? It, well, what people say is it's kind of a ginger ale meets elderflower, which is funny because it's one thing I don't like. And one thing we both love. <laughs> so, uh, so, ginger ale is a thing we don't like. Yeah. Elderflower is delicious. I really want to scratch. That's a great cap, by the way. It's a great cap. I hope we can salvage this. That's a twist off. That's good. Is it? Yeah, we should just take like a napkin mm -hmm. or a washcloth. Yeah, you know it's that? a twist off. What? It's a twist off. It's not what? Maybe it's not. <clears throat> Maybe okay. I'm just stupid. <clears throat> Hey man, you're better than that. But you know what? Let's just get the get the dragon. No, let's get to that contents. Okay, it smells like the root beer we've been trying to make. <laughs> so that's not a good thing, by the way. <laughs> I actually like the scent. No, I mean again, it's got a very neutral scent. It's not super spicy like a lot of those ginger ales can be. Kind of, you know, scary. <laughs> Ooh. Okay, that's a, that's a good woo, I think. Woo! That good. That is good. I like that. What is that flavor? It's like a, it's like a guarna meets... But isn't it kind of like... It's like a guarna meets <coughs> other flower. But I feel like it, it had, like, think about it. Apple. You taste apple. Yeah, you, you taste it in the beginning. I don't taste the grape. I think a white grape, maybe. Mm-hmm. That's good though. It is good. Little to no bubbles that I am tasting yeah, it's, during it's it. Light. It's very light. It's you can definitely tell when you put the bottle down. It is carbonated to an extent. Um, that's good. Um, it's like sparkling, sparkling cider, where it's not like you know, you're not it's not your at the mouth like a cheer wine. Yeah. But it's it's light like <clears> um. What are the sorts that we had that have been kind of, like a Nesbitt's almost, but with more, a little bit more than a Nesbitt's, you know? So, yeah. What would you rate it? Hmm. I mean, looks alone, color, bottle, taste, story. I don't know if you'd call it a story. It's, it, it's, 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 it's the fact cool. that it's, it's an a, international it's, soda yeah, is yeah. not something we have often. I'd give that baby an eight. <clears throat> an eight? That'd be a definite go. I, <laughs> that's something I would want to keep stocked in the fridge at all times. And I'm good luck. Alhamdulillah! That's a fun word to say. Alhamdulillah, alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah, alhamdulillah. I'm gonna give it an 8 as well. Uh, not a very original. I'm stealing you. Oh really? Wow. Real original! Hey buddy. You gotta be your own leader. Check yourself. Or you wreck yourself. Uh, I, <coughs> I'm gonna give it an 8. Again, I, like you said, I think it's a beautiful bottle. Which is, of course, what's important when you're buying a soda. It stands um, out, certainly. Oh, yeah. And, and I think the interesting thing is, is that it is, I mean, it's actually second in Austria to all selling sodas only behind Coke. 
So, you know, it's it's big in Austria. It's made a name for itself. <clears throat> so, yeah, but I think the cool thing is that it's actually, <coughs> we can get it here in the States. Granted, it was from Galco's, so that's kind of, you know, the... It's down, down the street. <laughs> I wish. But it's the, it's the catch-all of all soda places, you know. They had a whole bunch of international sodas. But the fact that you can get this, uh, and we'll put a link in the description, to a... Uh, I Two think, Galcos, the I website. Think specialty sodas can actually, you can get a hold of the soda. I believe yeah. so. so. So, I mean, that alone is kind of a, a nice thing. Well, be, thanks again for watching, guys. Be sure to like, subscribe, comment, you know. Give us some love. Give us some love. <laughs> thanks again for watching, guys. Thanks, guys. Bye. Bye.